Brian here with HelpSellMyRV.com out of Louisville, Kentucky, where all RVs are for sale by owner. I'm going to do a walk around on this beautiful, fully loaded 2017 Heartland Bighorn 3970RD luxury fifth wheel with five slides. Go ahead and get started on the inside and then finish up by showing you the outside. This is a full luxury fifth wheel, definitely not entry level. This is a Four Seasons camper. You could definitely live in this if you wanted to. Overall length, exterior length is 43 feet 8 inches and overall height is 13 feet 3 inches to the AC unit. And the dry weight on this camper when it came off the assembly line is 15,080 pounds. Give you an idea of the floor plan here before I get started. Okay, start back in the living room area here. This is a beautiful floor plan. Uh, this is five slides. First slide out is going to be one of the rear high to bed ultra leather sleeper sofas. The slide out is going to be right around uh, seven, maybe eight foot long, and it's about three foot deep. Beautiful LED light accent on the slide out fascia. You do have the ultra leather, high to bed sleeper option. All ultra leather is in excellent condition or leatherette. It's kind of a brown color. And you do have the pull down shades, sun visor shade, and the blackout shades. These are the ones you want now. You don't have those cheap accordion ones that are notorious for getting dirty and breaking. Okay, let's do the opposing slide out. Opposing slide out, this is going to be the second slide out, the same length, about a seven to eight foot long and about three foot deep. Uh, another matching sofa. It's a high to bed sleeper. Show off those window treatments there. Uh, the colors are going to be tans, uh, dark browns. Leave your cabinets, I think they're going to be a maple finish. And uh, your third sofa, it's going to be the theater seating with the LED light accent and the so, uh, cup holders here. Let me zoom in on that, show you. These are heated and massaging recliner chairs, dual recliners. Thomas Payne collection. Show that badge right there. It's a beautiful camper. Again, ultra leather on the theater seating and the rear TV is going to be a power lift TV uh, I believe it might be a 55 maybe even a 60 inch flat screen and it's a power lift there's a little button over here kind of puts it down you get the idea this, uh, this has full entertainment package this is a uh, Bluetooth ready, DVD, MP3, smart device ready. You can hook up uh, your any smart device to it. It has pretty much everything you can imagine. On well, stereo, uh, you do have this uh, little fireplace here, and that does give off heat. It's an electric fireplace. Show off the cabinets up here. It's that etched glass look, and it's going to be a brushed nickel hardware. You do have the ceiling fan. And the ceiling is actually going to be a panel look. So a lot of residential features on this coach. It's kind of a panel look. Uh, let me see if I can get the correct lighting. There we go. It's like the wall paneling you see in houses. It's definitely not your traditional RV ceiling. And your floor is going to be like a stone or a marble look linoleum it's all residential uh, linoleum stain resistant okay going into the kitchen area here this is going to be your third slide out it's going to be the freestanding table and chairs kind of back up here and show you that again it's going to be about seven maybe eight foot long and about three foot deep again the beautiful LED light accenting and nice residential style 
lighting above the table. This coach has an enormous amount of windows in it. Kind of show off the fabrics on the chairs. Again, everything's in excellent condition. There is a hide a leaf for the table. Okay, in your kitchen area here, let's start in the island. A nice center island kitchen floor plan. It is a Korean style solid surface countertops. Kind of give you an idea on that. And you do have the LED light accenting up underneath. Nice 110 outlet right there. Huge double bowl stainless steel sink. It's going to be one of the nicest kitchens you're going to find on a fifth wheel. Pull out sprayer faucet. Kind of back up and show you the cabinetry. Another 110 outlet right there. Here's your little light switch right there for the accent lighting up underneath. Okay, on your fourth slide out. It's the oven and your appliances that slide out and your pantry, huge pantry. Do you have a stain, stainless steel finish on all your appliances? Nice, beautiful residential style oven. Not the regular RV oven that you usually get. Beautiful three burner gas cooktop, stainless steel finish. Definitely a lot of residential features you can feel on that. Again, Corian countertops. Corian countertops are all through this camper. Nice. It's got a Corian backsplash. It's a kind of a tile. And you do have the convection oven. Nice big convection oven. LED lights. Let me back up here on, on the refrigerator. This is going to be the 18 cubic foot residential refrigerator. It's by Frigidaire. Gallery edition. There's that Frigidaire badge. Uh, this does have a standalone inverter. I believe it's going to be a thousand watt inverter so it keeps the refrigerator cold while you're going down the road. This does have the ice maker. And you do have the water dispenser option in ice dispenser option here on the door which is definitely nice come back up and show you the other side of the fridge again stainless steel finish on all your appliances one of the best refrigerators you're going to find on a fifth wheel definitely more cabinet space it's kind of your hutch area here nice etched glass again corian style countertops solid surface uh, all your drawer fronts, everything. The cabinetry is going to be some of the best you're going to find in a fifth wheel. Speed the video up a little bit. Side aisle hallway. You do have uh, accent or safety lighting for at night. Going up into the master bedroom here. It's got the king bed. King bed lifts up. Nice headboard. LED light accent. Reader lights above the headboard. It's going to be your fifth slide out. It's again going to be about seven, maybe. Uh, eight foot long and it's about three foot deep. Closet in the rear and you do have the washer and dryer stackable unit which I'll show you here. I'll go ahead and show it to you. It's the Splendid line stackable washer and dryer. Uh, this coach is 50 amp service of course. I'll show you the Huge walk-in style closet with light. Turn that one off. Nice walk-in closet on the other side. Nice light there. There's one tin outlet right there. You do have, I want to point out, USB charging ports on each side of the bed charging up smart devices which is definitely a nice feature I do want to show off that headboard it kind of made like a rustic wood accenting around the padded headboard there not sure where the pillows are you do have a, another dresser over there 
and there's a USB charging port over there also. Uh, it's going to be your second TV. I believe it's going to be about a 19, maybe a 22 inch flat screen and more storage, dresser space. And your AC units on these is going to be two AC units, probably 15,000 and a 13,500 BTU AC units. And they're all ultra quiet. Show up the beautiful bathroom here. Beautiful one piece shower. Sit down garden shower. Skylight. Foot flush porcelain toilet. And Corian countertops in the bathroom, also. Nice medicine cabinet. You have a fantastic vent fan. There's a little button for your fantastic vent fans. You've got fantastic vent fans all over this coach. So there's one right there. And there's one also in the bedroom, in the bathroom. Show you your monitor panel here. Uh, it does have the Onan generator, uh, it only has uh, 42 hours on it. And buttons for your slide outs. This is going to be uh, for your awning lights and your power awning. This is going to be your, it does have the Yeti package. It uh, definitely goes into cold seats. It's basically zero degree rated uh, heater for your, for your lines and for your uh, tanks, tank pad heaters. And monitors for your holding tanks. And these are your switches. Kind of figure that one out. I'm trying to speed up my videos. They're getting a little long. Go outside. Yeah, I'm going too fast. I need to turn off that generator. So I'm not yelling. Okay. Back up here. Beautiful front molded fiberglass cap. I'm calling this a high high gloss uh, finish. It looks like a gel coat to me, but uh, definitely the front cap is going to be a gel coat finish. Beautiful design there. Exterior speakers here. One tin outlet right here. A frameless tinted windows. And the awning is going to be, I think, maybe an 18 foot power awning. Fully adjustable, and you do have LED lights. It's going to be 40 pound, 30 pound LP tank, one on each side. Huge storage, garage area, uh, insulated baggage doors, slam latch baggage doors, which with uh, the uh, gas struts. Huge storage. You do have tie downs in there too. Slam latch baggage doors are great. Another 110 outlet right here. You do have this uh, aluminum steps here that they're offering now. They don't bind up and they look nicer. You do have the six point auto level system on this coach. I did check this coach for delamination, which is the uh, bubbling you get on the outside. I did check for stress cracks around the slide outs. Did not find any issues with this coach. It does have the full awning package slide out awning package back up here give you an idea of what that coach coach looks like on the outside on the front rear side here beautiful nice uh, rear molded fiberglass cap ladder to get up on your full walk-on roof it's a full aluminum frame construction there's your full enclosed heated underbelly you can it's basically zero degree rated there's your spare tire there definitely go into cold seasons with this or uh, go down south or out west and be pretty comfortable. Some of the best uh, insulation in the business. Uh, you've got R40 insulation in the roof and I think R38 in the floor. Do you have a G-rated tires? Uh, they're going to be the 16s. 16 inch aluminum alloys and they are the 8 lug wheels. I believe that's access to your garbage can in the kitchen. There's your six point auto leveling jacks. There, there's your furnace. I'm not sure what size it is. Probably a 40,000 BTU furnace, uh, 12 gallon uh, gas electric direct spark ignition water heater. It's your water hookup station here. It's all enclosed, heated. Uh, your gate valves or dump valves are all protected. Uh, black tank sewer flush right there. 
and your freshwater holding tank. That's where you hook it up here and hook it up to city. Uh, I believe it's going to be a 67 gallon freshwater uh, holding tank. Outside shower. There's your cable hookups right there. And this is your auto level system right there. And it does have memory. It remembers where you are on your truck. And again, insulated slam latch baggage doors. 30 pound LP tank here. Right there. Kind of show you what it looks like on the back side here. All the decals, excellent condition. Nice big horn badge there. Show off that generator. It's the 5500. Zoom in on that. 5500 LP generator by Onan. One of the best generators you can get. Dual batteries on this coach. There's your selector switches for your slide outs in case you wanted to put leave some in. You have that option. All right. I know I didn't get everything, but I do apologize. I'm trying to rush my videos. These will be under 20 minutes. Okay. If you want to come see the camper? Just call the number on the edge. You deal directly with the owner. If you like this video, I'd appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date on RVs coming for sale by owner in the Kentucky area, you can always follow HelpSellMyRV.com on Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, and YouTube. Thank you.